go to the Wedio.co site and sign up. You can sign up using Facebook or Google Plus or use your email address. Once you've signed up and logged in, click on either New Video or Create a New Video. You can choose from a range of templates depending on what your project is. Or you can create your own. Once the editing interface is open, you'll see a stage at the centre and your different slides in your in your video to the right and on the left you can select from different objects to add to the stage. The first thing you can do is select a background, click on back and then scroll through the different backgrounds that you can add to your video stage. Click and open the object library. You can choose from a range of objects. The first three groups are free. You can scroll through the different objects you can add. When you click on an object, it will appear on the stage. When you click on the object again, you'll see you have a number of different things that you can do to the object. If you click on Edit, you can change the opacity and brightness of the object. If you don't like it, you can click on Swap change it for something else, or you can delete it. To make the object move, click on Animate Object. Position it where you want it to begin, and click on Define Start. Now move the object, and click on Confirm Movement. Move the object again, click on Confirm Movement again. Now to see how well that will look, click on Scene and the Play button. And here you'll see how your object will move. You can add text to your video. Type the text in. If you want the text to be bigger, click on it and then drag the corners. You can also reposition the text. You can change to different fonts or colors and you can even animate your text. Just click Confirm Movement each time you move it. And then once again, you can watch your scene. You can add sound, either a voiceover, which you'll need to record first and import, or you can import your own music, or you can select something from the library.
just click on use and the audio will load. You can control the volume so that it's not too loud. Finally, you can upload your own images, sound and background. Just click on upload and you can upload these from your hard drive. To add the next part of your video, click on add and you'll see the next stage automatically appears. It has the same background but you can change it to a different background or you can use the same one. Once again you can add different objects and different text. When you've finished you can click on save and write in a title and a description and add tags. Click on save changes And when you're ready to share, click on share. You can then copy the link or copy an embed code. Or you can download the video to your hard drive. If you have an account on YouTube, you can upload it directly to YouTube or share it on Twitter or Facebook. If you click on your image and then my videos, you can find the videos that you've already created and saved, edit them again, delete them, or view them. Here you can copy the, the link to the video, or also find an embed code.